Hey everybody, welcome to KP's Health Tips. So today's health tip, I'm always looking for well-being. Not just the whole workout component, but how your well-being is. So today I'm gonna to tackle the issue of stress. This is also one of the key areas when I meet with a client, we discuss stress and how that's affecting them on an everyday basis. So keys to dealing with stress. So currently we're in a pandemic. Stress levels are very high right now here, specifically to Cape Cod, from our senior population to people with health conditions and really everybody. So for those that know me, one of my mantras is get outside and move. I'm a big fan of conservation here on Cape Cod. I clean up the areas pretty much everywhere I go, picking trash up. I love the ocean. I love Cape Cod. So part of de-stressing and dealing with stress is trying to recognize when it happens and ways to accommodate or deal with stress. First for me would be get outside more connect with nature. We live in a really amazing location here on Cape Cod. Here on Cape Cod, we have bays, we have the Sounds, Martha's Vineyard in Nantucket Sound, we have the Atlantic Ocean, we have the bike paths, we have walking trails, state parks, state forests. We have a lot of opportunities to not only get outside and enjoy these amazing spots, but here on Cape, we can stay socially distant because we have so many spots here, if you're aware of them within your town. So getting outside, connecting with nature, some of the things that you benefit from here, you know, you're gonna be outside breathing fresh air, you're moving your body, which is always beneficial. And during these walks, your mind becomes creative and the de-stressing is going on. What's happening there in your brain, you're releasing a chemical called serotonin. So serotonin is considered your, the happy chemical. And this chemical gets released and it basically is a signal that goes from your brain throughout your body. It makes you feel good. So it's gonna help you feel good, which is gonna reduce anger, help you with maybe dealing with some fear you might be dealing with. Pleasant feelings are gonna come. Uh, your blood pressure will lower, your heart rate's gonna lower, your lift, your spirits are gonna happen. It's gonna boost endorphins. So overall, things are gonna get better, guaranteed when you go outside, specifically to the beach. Uh, I'm a huge fan of being at the beach. And what happens at the beach when you see the waves hitting the shoreline? Negative ion rich oxygen is happening there. So when you breathe in that oxygen at the beach, it immediately starts to calm you down and relax your brain, your body. That's why when you leave after a day at the beach, specifically in the summer, you feel great. I feel great every time I leave the beach. And when I have triggers of anxiety, stress, not feeling so great, I get outside and almost every time for sure, I feel better. So getting outdoors is hugely instrumental to our well-being. We want to fight off that chemical called cortisol. So cortisol is the alarm system stress hormone in our body. It's the complete opposite of serotonin. It's the steroid hormone. It's the flight or fight chemical that you feel when you get anxious. And that's something you don't want to have to deal with. So when you recognize that, get outside. Get outside. If you're into it, at the beach, take those shoes off and connect let your skin touch the earth so this is my health tip of the day take the opportunity to get outside especially in this pandemic definitely want to promote taking a mask with you or your buff stay six feet away know the spot specifically in your town with the conservation lands try to keep the distance and get outside and keep moving i know it's hard and we're dealing with a lot right now but guarantee Time Outdoors is going to benefit you. Hope you enjoy this. Stay well, everybody. See you soon.